Welcome back everyone. In today's episode, I'm going to share with you an emergency kit that I've created to help overly sensitive people during a crisis. I'm RJ and this is RJ's Homestyle. Hello everyone, thank you for joining me today. The project I'm presenting today has been brought about by the current atmosphere in society. Personally for me, I'm finding that some people are just a little soft around the edge, uh, a little bit oversensitive, and I really like to help people. So I've created what I'm calling an emergency kit for oversensitive people. Now here are the supplies you're going to need if you'd like to make one of these to help people in your home. First, you're going to need a display box or a shadow box. This is the one I chose and I've already painted it red as red is an emergency color and it quickly helps to identify something you might need during an emergency. You're also going to need a set of pearls now, while you could use grandma's pearls, I highly recommend finding you a cheap pair, maybe at a thrift store or some like these that I purchased at Walmart for $4.98. This is going to be very simple. You're simply going to take those pearls and you're going to mount them on a piece of cardstock or black foam core board using some hot glue. Just put it in the shape of a necklace. Now, there will be some words on the emergency kit, as all emergency kits, emergency kits do have instructions on them. Now, you can use peel and stick stickers from the Dollar Tree. This is just one style. You can find a style that works for you. I, however, decided to put my Cricut Maker to work, and I had those words designed in design space. I then had those words cut out in vinyl. I then had those vinyl words attached to the glass of my display box. And this is what I created. Now I know I am being somewhat cheeky here, but this actually falls in the realm of my humor. There's an awful lot of pearl clutching going on all over the place. And this is just my attempt at some humor. I find it very funny. People in my home have found it very funny. And if you have the cheeky kind of humor that I have, I think you found it funny too. And I think this would just be a wonderful way of expressing how you feel about oversensitive people. Now, in full transparency and disclosure, I did not come up with this idea. This random photo was sent to me by a friend who knew that my humor would be right on track for this, and it certainly was. I have no clue who the original artist or creator of this item is, but it definitely spoke to my brand of humor, and I hope you have enjoyed this humorous craft. For more great information on how to style your home, check out these previous episodes shown here. Remember to like, comment, and share on these videos, and to make sure you see the next new episode, hit the subscription button and the notification bell, and you will be good to go. As always, bye for now.